everybody. Welcome to Workshop Live. Workshop it Live. Yeah, I'm here with Kelly, and uh, we are so excited to invite you to this new episode. And uh, once again, it's going to be awesome. We are excited to uh, to check it out. We're excited about this week, the beginning this of is October. October. Woo, spooky. Spooky. No, it's going to be a fun month. It's going to be a fun week, but we need to see what we did last week, right? Okay. So what do we need to do, Kelly? Let's check, check it out. excited can you tell I'm so excited um, I gotta show you something this is crazy but I uh, just wanted you to know that uh, miracles happen and last week I introduced you to one of my new friends and um, let's see if I can flip this camera and look he came back we really are friends hey buddy how we doing welcome back to the PC workshop glad you could come back Hopefully we can uh, hang out some more. Talk to you later. Hello everybody, I'm Johnny. And now here is the weather for next week. It's going to be mostly sunny skies up until Friday. And then on Friday will be a chance of rain. So bring a raincoat or galoshes or whatever on Friday. <laughs> hey, everybody. It's time to get some sports updates. We got Timmy. Hi. And Robert. 
And uh, we got a lot to get to, so let's get after it. Hey, we're going to start with college football. College football had a busy weekend. Once again, we're a week behind. We understand. But once again, we're just having a good old time. Man, we had a big game. Ohio State played Notre Dame. They got a win. The Fighting Irish, and they got a win. Literally on the last second of the game. See you, the you guys. Late <laughs> Irish, laddie. I know. You guys love that Irish accent. Yeah, it was literally the last second of the game, wasn't it, Tim? Yeah, it was. Buckeyes won. Buckeyes won. Ran across that goal line. It was a great game. And, can, um, can I say it? With one what? second left. Oh, wait. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Oh, my gosh. All right. Um, I'm sure you all joined in. Um, so, Notre Dame came out 17-14. to 14. I mean, uh, Ohio State came out yeah, on top. Yeah, Sorry about that. And 17-14. Uh, to 14. Next game was Michigan. They played the Rutgers, and uh, they won pretty handedly. Uh, they beat the Rutgers. Does anyone want to say? 31-7. Seven. 7. 31-7. Seven. to seven. Uh, My team, Alabama, Good roll time. Yeah, they actually started to look like Alabama. Thank Good you. Job. Thank you. That's yeah, that's wins. right. Look at all the support I'm getting here. <laughs> uh, they played Ole Miss, and uh, it was supposed to be a tough game. We came out 24 to 10. Uh, Minnesota. Victory. Actually, I got these scores wrong. I think they lost, actually. Uh, okay. uh, so I think those are supposed to be reversed. The last one is to be. Error on the set here. Yeah. Uh, Northwestern beat Minnesota, actually. Sorry, Jamie. Uh, 34 or 37 to 34. Yeah. Um, all right. Well, there we go. Hey, uh, and then uh, the Kentucky Wildcats won again. Go Michael B. Um, not sure exactly what the score was, but we'll put it on the bottom of the screen here, and you can see. But they were victorious once again. All right. On to the NFL. A lot of scores. First one, Robert. My Eagles. What happened? <laughs> Who did they beat? Temporary Buccaneers. Can you give us a little song? The Eagles fight song? Fly, Eagles, fly. I can't say the rest. That was good. That was good. All right. So the Eagles came out on top 25 to 11. Can I say it? Yeah. They monkey stopped them. <laughs> they monkey stopped them. All right. Uh, Dallas Cowboys were in action, and they lost. It was a rough one to the Cardinals. Are you kidding me? Uh, Cowboy fans, you should uh, you should be an ostrich and bury your head in the sand. That was a terrible <laughs> loss. Um, the Lions came out on top. Uh, Charles, the Lions beat my Falcons. That's what I get for trash talking the Lions last week. Twenty to six. Twenty to six. Man, not a good day <laughs> for my Falcons. Uh, the Vikings. Ooh, Jamie. Pillows again. Jamie, man. Coach, coach on them. Yeah, exactly. 28 the, 24. The, they got beat by the Chargers. Uh, the Browns, they had a good day. Yeah, we're in 27 to 3. 27 to 3 against the Titans. And uh, last. Bengals and the Lions. They got the win, 1915. The, the Bengals finally got in the win column. Yeah. It's been a rough start, but uh, they finally got in the win column. They beat the Rams 19 to 16. Uh, we're also excited about our local teams. Antwerp high school football teams having a great season. They are undefeated. Um, Wayne Trace is having a pretty good season. Uh, the Pony Panthers. And the Pony Panthers. We have a winning record. That is yeah, crazy. We got a tie game going. Wayne Tra so no, we're going to be nice. We're going to be nice. Wayne Trace and uh, Timmy, you're going to the game tonight, right? I hope so. I hope Holding so. homecoming. And uh, I think Antwerp's playing Wayne Trace. And so we, uh, we want to keep up on that once again because all our teams are doing well and we love and support them, right? Well, hey, that's the sports. And uh, once again, fun week. We'll, uh, we'll, we'll keep track, right? Mm -hmm. keep we'll keep track. Boys. Thanks. All right, here with Becky. And uh, last week, Becky, we started something fun. Yeah. What did we start? Oh, food. A food bracket? Bracket. We are we are striving to see what our favorite fast food restaurant is at PC Workshop. Yep. It just so happens we're getting a Taco Bell. Right on. Oh, man. It's been forever. We've been... I've lived here for like 10 years, and they've been talking about getting a Taco Bell the whole time. And uh, they broke ground. And so it's just appropriate that we're kind of doing this fast food bracket. Last week, Tim Hortons won. Yep. I think you picked Tim Hortons, right? No. I did not, but uh, that's all right. The, the the numbers have spoken. And this week we may try to do a couple. And um, and so Tim Hortons moves on. And uh, let's see uh, who who wins this week, yeah? Right. All right, here we go. Fast food bracket.
Marcos. Dairy Queen. Marcos. Dairy Queen. That's a tough one. I like Marcos. Marcos. Thank you. Pizza. Dairy Queen because of their pizzas. Wait, what? Because of their uh, ice cream. Dairy Queen. Dairy Queen. Dairy Queen all the way. Dairy Queen. Both. I mean, Marcos. Dairy Queen. Dairy Queen. DQ. I'm going to say Dairy Queen for their blizzards. Dairy Queen. DQ. Marco. Dairy Queen or Marco? Dairy Queen? Dairy Queen it is. Marcos. Marcos, for sure. Got to go with the Queen. Marcos. Dairy Queen? Dairy Queen. Dairy Queen. Dairy Queen. Dairy Queen. Dairy Queen. Ooh, I'm a McDonald's guy. All right. McDonald's. All right. Taco Bell. Uh, Taco Bell, because I will quote something from Invader Zim. I need tacos or else I will explode. Taco Bell. I would say McDonald's. Taco Bell. Uh, Taco Bell. Taco Bell. Hmm. McDonald's. Um, Taco Bell. Taco Bell. Oh, Taco Bell. I'm going to have to say McDonald's. McDonald's? Um, McDonald's. Taco Bell! This is hard. McDonald's. Taco Bell. I like a Taco Bell. Mm, Taco Bell. Big dollars. <laughs> I'll go with McDonald's. Taco Bell! Taco Bell. Well, I'll choose McDonald's. Okay. McDonald's. Taco Bell. Hmm. Taco Bell? Yeah, that's it. McDonald's? Taco Bell. Taco Bell. I guess I'm going to put McDonald's. McDonald's. Taco Bell. McDonald's. everybody we are back and uh it's that time of uh in the episode where we kind of just get some words uh to get through life it's it's good for all of us it's good for me just to to take a deep breath and to relax and to uh hear some wisdom from our friend and um and who uh who gives us these words Rhonda? i would say uh cowboys stag boy yes yep and what does he give us he give us uh a credit Words to get through life? Yes, this is life. Words to get through life, all right? And so uh, we're excited, and uh, once again, let's say take it away, Static Boy. Static Boy, can Static Boy. Being healthy is really important. The more healthy we are, the more we're able to do good for others and, and, and ourselves. Be, being healthy is something that's really worthwhile. Hey, well, uh, man, it's been a great episode so far, hasn't it? Yes, it has. Man, it's so fun. And, uh, but we are coming to the end. And so we just want to talk a little bit about this week. Um, this week will be pretty normal. Yeah, we got... Yeah. Um, Health and fitness on Monday. We got movie making on Tuesday. We have uh, karate um, this week. Yes, we do have karate this week. Yeah, and swimming and yeah. music class. Yeah. Yeah, so it should mm-hmm. be a fun week. But we wanted to give you a heads up about next Monday, October yeah. the 9th. What's happening on October the 9th? There's going to be an end service that day, so the workshop will be closed that day. Right, and uh, you guys can't see it, but everybody around us is dancing right now. They are so excited. Uh, I'm not sure why. I think it's fun to hang out with me. I'm sure, <laughs> I don't know. They, they're just uh, they're excited. They don't have to see me on next Monday, but uh, you never know, right? Yeah. Never know. So uh, let's be excited. Let's get uh, prepared for the week. And uh, once again, um, do everything you ha- we're doing, whether it be class or work or whatever, with 100%. Yes. 
that'd be great doing it a hundred percent so you get everything done that you need to be getting done there you go couldn't have said it better let's have a great week together yeah yeah catch you later <laughs>